Hey, I want to be completely honest with you guys. I'm struggling with this truth and maybe you too. And he reads like this. Do not love the world or anything in the world. If anyone loves the world, love for the Father is not in them. Sounds scary, right? It is. For everything in the world, the last of the flesh, the last of the eyes, and the pride of life comes not from the Father, but from the world. The world and its desires pass away, but whoever does the will of God lives forever. Amen. This is from 1 John chapter 2. You see, believers are to love God and one another, and not the world or possession. The word world is not referring to the planet or even material things. The word world is actually a reference to the fallen man-centered system or way of life, which means you center your belief system only on your own strength and beliefs and actions without the need of God. Means you take away God. <laughs> which can lead people to be prideful and the cravings of your body to last and so on, which will lead to sin. And I'm no different. It's very unfortunate. Many people, even Christians, will deny they are prideful or even deny they have an issue for lust or cravings. I'll be honest, as a very start, I had these issues even today. And that's why we need Jesus every day to come right to Him today. And if that's you, I want to pray for you right now. Father, I pray right now in the name of Jesus, I command all pride, cravings of the flesh, and all the last to live in the name of Jesus and renew their bodies right now and forgive them for whatever deeds they have done. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. If you believe, comment amen below, share this video, and follow me to grow your faith. So remember, if you love God today, start growing your relationship with Him through prayer, reading of the Bible, so that you can understand God's will for your life. And trust me, once you know it, you'll live a fruitful and happy life.